Filling and connecting the water filter, along with a few final touches, makes this fish tank ready for its first resident. Native to warm waters and noted for its tiger-like stripes, the lionfish is making a splash. It's in the ocean, not in streams, uh, freshwater or freshwater lakes. The lionfish is being seen now off the coast of the United States. Because more people are having tanks, they're getting more exotic species, it's easier to bring them in, that we're also seeing it more in people's homes. The lionfish may look beautiful, but a touch from one of these tentacles could send a dose of poison into your system. The Blue Ridge Poison Center at the University of Virginia Health System has seen an increase in calls concerning these types of encounters. Being stung on the hand as opposed to the chest, yeah, you may have more problems or more chance of having systemic signs and symptoms if you're stung on the chest. It's going to be still mainly pain regardless of where you're stung. And these medical students are learning the difference thanks to a grant from Bama Works, the nonprofit foundation started by the Dave Matthews Band to fund positive projects in and around Charlottesville, Virginia. Dr. Christopher Holsteg, director of toxicology at UVA Health System, bought the fish to use as a teaching tool. Uh, I think in teaching we're learning that using visuals, doing hands-on things such as simulation and such have benefits and people retain their knowledge better. But a sting from a lionfish doesn't have to mean a trip to the doctor. Holsteg recommends soaking the affected area in warm water to take the pain out of the sting. Then call the poison center for further instructions. For the University of Virginia Health System, I'm Abina Foreman reporting.